So you've gotten good at doing the regular front plank. I'm going to show you how you can start to progress that and make it more challenging. This variation here is actually something people do when they set up and it's an incorrect thing because they're, they're making the, the plank harder, but they're doing it unintentionally. If you're doing this by design, it's a fantastic progression. If you're doing it because you set up poorly, you're going to struggle doing your planks. So this is called a rocking plank. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna move from a position of having the elbow under the shoulder to rocking back so your elbow is out in front of your shoulder. Don't set up this way unless you mean to set up this way because it makes it a lot harder. This one we're gonna rock back and forth from more what we're gonna call a long lever position back to the regular front plank position. Come back to our modified position to start. So I'm gonna start here. I'm gonna come up here. Now I'm gonna rock back on my toes this way, and then I'm gonna come forward. So rocking back challenges the abs a little bit more. When the elbows get out in front of the shoulders, this becomes a little bit more challenging. So make sure you're doing it by design. A lot of people, when they set up for their regular planks, their elbows are out in front and they struggle because they're actually moving, it's a progression their body's not ready for, okay? So make sure if you're doing it, do it by design. So this uh, variation, is meant to rock back and forth. One key point, when you rock back forward, don't get your shoulders too far forward. What a lot of people do is they rock too far this way. Remember, elbows under the shoulders, and you're gonna go back from there, and then just come back to that point. It's not a huge range of motion, and that's okay. Sometimes, just because you can go further, doesn't mean you should go further. 